Man, what a beauty. What's going on, you guys? This is Anton, a.k.a. The Big Fella, bringing you another video. First and foremost, I want to thank you guys for your well wishes of me having the flu. Feeling a lot better right now. Not 100%. But, um, you know, good enough to be up and moving about. I may uh, go ahead and do some stuff to the boat today. It's kind of chilly out here, and I don't want to, you know, risk getting sick again. So I'll probably hold off on that until later on in the week when it's supposed to get up into the 60s. Uh, meanwhile, I may run downstairs and start getting the uh, old YouTube studio together finally. I'm uh, putting the finishing touches on that. Got that uh, deer skull over there that I'm going to incorporate in there somewhere as well. But um, let me go ahead and get in here and uh, start straightening up and getting it all together all right you guys I'm down here in the basement um, as you can see it's uh, just a storage area and stuff going on um, the basement is uh, split into two parts you got the stairs that you come down and then you got one area here and another area here I'm gonna turn this side where the door is into my YouTube studio slash man cave and um, my wife's planning on hanging up some curtains and stuff for me so none of this looks all blase blah and whatnot but I um, got a little bit of stuff to move around, so let me go ahead and get to moving this stuff. And um, got a TV that's going down here, all that good stuff, so it uh, should turn out pretty nice. Well, you guys got uh, one of the most important parts of a man cave up, the TV. Now, I know it's not a monster-sized TV by any means, but it'll suit my needs for down here. Wow. One of my ancestors. Well, you guys, so far we got this side looking amazing. We're about to mop this and then uh, put some uh, old carpet tiles down. All right, you guys, I got everything where I needed to be. Got the TV and everything set up. Of course, little fella's down here helping me out. And um, got the reclining couch here. This one is going to go over here, but uh, we just got to move the rest of that junk out of the way. And um, But, yeah, it's coming together. Oh, got some carpet down. It's just some... Um, it's good carpet, but it was carpet that was taken out of a house that um, replaced the carpet. So I had it and I put it down here in the basement. But um, yeah, it's all coming together. Um, next thing we need to do is uh, we're going to be getting curtains and covering all this plastic that covers the insulation. And I'm going to be getting me a curtain that uh, covers all that stuff back there. So it's all coming together, but uh, about to go upstairs and um, watch some TV. Or maybe I'll sit down here and watch TV because I got a TV down here now. That lake was frozen over pretty good. I actually sat there for a while and was throwing rocks at the ice to see if I could get it to crack and couldn't get the ice to crack at all. Um, I was taking rocks and, you know, bombing them up in the air to see if they'd go through and I was also beaming it at the ice and it was just bouncing off. But um, it's supposed to be 58 degrees today and then 68 tomorrow, so maybe some of that ice will melt. I probably will be back down that way uh, later on in the week, so maybe I'll be able to do some fishing there. Don't know yet. We'll see. But um, another guy had to happen to stop by the uh, lake as well while I was there and said it's been frozen for a couple weeks now, so uh, it may be a little bit. Uh, I'm not sure how thick that ice is, but it may be a little bit before it actually melts all the way. Ponds in my old neighborhood aren't covered as bad. Let's check out the medium sized one. This is the small one here. Oh, the medium sized one is over there. It's got some ice spots in it. I can't really tell. But uh, let's go check out the bigger size one. Well, it's not covered in ice where I normally fish at. Hmm. Well, you guys are home, and I'm going to go ahead and do some stuff to the boat. Guess not, it's starting to rain. My luck. Mind you, the sun has been out all day long, and uh, it was a low chance of rain this afternoon, but uh, I guess that low chance changed into a high chance, and um, now I can't do anything to the boat until tomorrow, if I get off in time with some daylight. Well, you guys, it's been a rough week. So rough, in fact, I wasn't able to get a Wednesday video out for you guys, so I apologize about that. Also, I want to apologize about the content in this video. I know it wasn't much, but... Um, I wanted to post something for you guys. Um, also wanted to let you guys know I'm doing all right now. I think I'm completely over the flu. So I thank you guys again for the well wishes that y'all gave me and all the messages and stuff. But um, I want to make it up to you guys for the lack of uh, good content here lately. So uh, drop a random comment down there in the comment section below and I'll pick a random winner in next Saturday's video 
um, to receive a $25 Menace Bates gift card. Um, if you're interested in to see what they're having to offer, just hop on over to www.menacebaits.com and uh, check out the awesome jigs and stuff that they have over there. I catch plenty of fish on them, so I wanted to uh, give you guys a chance to get some stuff over there. Um, but I think that's going to do it for this episode of Big Fella Outdoors. Be sure to tune into the next episode. You can catch me outside doing what I love most, getting my dose of the great outdoors. Be sure to get y'all's too.